Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to Best Life and Beyond. We are here in downtown Disney, more specifically. The home store. That is correct. We wanted to come and do a big merch search for you. We decided that we're gonna do an update here and go through every store that we can, especially as they begin to start opening while we wait for Disneyland. Yeah. So let's go through and do a fun little merch search. You're welcome. Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, we will. <laughs> Okay. I always love looking up and going, we're home when we first get in. Home. Home. Well, all of this is new. Look at this whisk. I like these. What are those? I want to pick it up, but I don't want to pick up. because So, by the way, you guys, if we can't show you prices on everything, it's because we're trying not to touch stuff unless we're actually considering buying it. Right. So I We'll do our best, but the, yeah, yeah. We'll do the best we could. Right here is a new thing, too. They recommend cashless payment. That's smart. So try to use that when you can. These are some cute little salt and pepper shakers to match those new mugs. Oh, I like that. Um, I'm yeah, it's the same design, yeah. I'm wondering what the price would be. They almost look like espresso, uh, but they're smaller. <laughs> no, I think they probably do have those too. And this oven mitt is classic. It's, it's, it's obviously the Mickey, you see the lines on the top there. Hey, look, we have a price tag, $14.99. $14.99. And you can see there's actually designs inside, like Small World. It's oh, that print right there. That's pretty cool. I love that. So I can see the price on one of these, and they're $16.99. And it's a Mickey whisk. Oh, it's a whisk. It's a whisk. A whisk. How cute is that? Oh, and the little teapot. That's a little teapot, short and stout. <laughs> Mickey Mouse is what it's all about. Oh, I love that. Boom. That was Freestyler. Good. That was good. This is a corn holder. Oh, is it? I, now, I, how great is that? I thought it was a back scratcher, but it's, it's corn holder. That's yeah, cool. Yeah, and it looks like Mickey hands are holding it. That is so cool. And we've seen this mug before, obviously, the Mickey pants, Mickey lower yes. half. Mickey and Minnie pants. Yeah. Magnet slash bottle opener. And this is a dual purpose item, you guys. That's beautiful. It's a twofer. It's and if so you look, pretty. you almost got a hidden Mickey set up. Plates are really cool. Look at that. Look at all the colors. It's all the character colors. Oh, those are nice plates. Right? I would love to have those plates at home. Hey, oh, look. I love these. Oh, I wonder plate? how much those are. I don't know. I use this all the time. This is, I'd say, my favorite kitchen tool right here. This and tongs. That is so classic. I'm very, these are $14.99, I can see. Oh, yeah, because there's the, the tongs and then the spatch. The spoons. Yeah, th this is like my favorite item I've ever had. I have to say, there's Bullseye, Drizella. The She's Oodles. so unhappy, isn't she? Drizella and Anastasia, I think are their names. And I love coming and revisiting this this D that they have in here is amazing. That's Disneyland so Hotel nice. kind of homage art. So, and then as well as the Disneyland sign yeah. is 150 before your discount. And then the shadow box version is really intricate. We always see this artist at at Disneyana. Yeah, I like the Toontown N. Yeah. Dude, this is so cool because you have the it's castle, the lights. Main, Main Street is the S. Yeah. What is that? Uh, Frontierland, maybe? Yep, it is, yeah. So is the next one. I don't know. Or the end might be. Adventureland. Yeah, this could be Adventureland and then Frontierland. Then. Uh, or maybe it's just. Haunted Mansion, obviously. The green one. Matterhorn. Right. Toontown. Tomorrowland. Oh, Tomorrowland. Look at all these puzzles. The puzzler. I prefer. I prefer the park map. That would be my choice if I was going to get one of these. Although the classic attraction posters, that's, that's that I think I would choose that over the map now. Yeah, me too. Ooh, look at that Space Mountain. That. Space Mountain. Now in stereophonic sound, Katie. Space Mountain. Look at Hatbox Ghost Stitch. Hattie Stitch. Beauty and the Beast. Spencer, I very much want this for our couch. I like that. A lot. We'll get it. You know we'll end up sleeping on that. Binky. Right. And she'll be very <laughs> she'll sit happy right there in the castle. <laughs> I want this so bad. I think we might get this. Even their displays are very classic here. Look at this whole set. This is beautiful because it's like subtle. Yeah. You know? Oh, I love these coffee cups and bowls. Look at this. Oh, I love the little cutting board. That's cool that it's a half and half. Oh, I would love that in my kitchen. It's like subtle Mickey's like that. Like, oh. Yeah, this whole uh, line is really cool. It's it's like that coffee. Spices? You know, I have that one coffee cup that's it's that subtle design where it yeah. looks, if you look at it, you wouldn't think it was Disney and then you look close. Yeah. You know? Look at these cups. Yeah, look at that. Oh my gosh. They're all raised. Those are so beautiful. I would love to enjoy a nice icy cold soda in one of those. I'm a fan of this style too. 
the sweetest pie, the cherries. Yeah, it reminds me of Bob's Big Boy a little bit for yeah. some reason. And that whole line, like, what is it, sweetest pie, is that what you said? Yeah, it's like the cherries. Yeah, it's just... All, like, oh, that is, that is really cute. I love the pie and the cake plate. Oh yeah, Swedish pie. This is where you store your magical ingredients. As opposed to, you know, you don't want regular flour or no. things in there. It's no. got to be magical. And look at these retro mugs, huh? A set of two. Even the shelving here. Look at the little Mickey accoutrements on just the shelving in the store. That's so cool. You wouldn't, you wouldn't know it in this mask, but I got a smile from ear to ear. And we've already previewed the 65th anniversary merch over at World of Disney, but this little setup is quite sweet with the mugs. This Didn't Charlie? Really Charlie got this one. So did we. Did we? Yeah, you don't. I love that you don't remember. I don't. That's awesome. And here's the 65th frame, and now you can actually see it in all its glittering glory. Yeah, look at the castle. Look, look how pretty that is. And the keychains are on better display here for sure. I love those. Look at Mickey. Are you serious, Mickey? Do you have to look that cute? I think because the lighting in this store is really oh, yeah, primo like compared to oh, yeah. World of Disney. I, I love World of Disney, but the lighting in here is way better. more is conducive. Oh my! They have whole ink and paint collection over there. So we never even got the whole collection like like this, where we didn't get the silicone coloring placemat, so you can color those yourself. Now, does it stay permanent or? Yeah, it stays permanent. That's really cool. And those mugs, oh my gosh, those mugs. There's the old palette. Is it, what is that, like a serving tray? Yeah, like a yeah. serving tray. And then uh, these are napkin holders. Now this right here is a color changing mug. So as you put hot water in it, it uh, gets colorful and it paints itself. So you can kind of see. Kind of in the negative space in the white section. No, the colors, oh, the, the colors characters. Change. Okay. Yeah, it'll basically turn into that, like how the bowl looks. Now obviously you can paint a napkin as well. Is that what that is? Maybe, I would assume with some fabric markers, you could certainly do that. And look at the plates. Oh yeah. I think some of them are meant to not have color on them. Well, of course, because you know? I don't think you're going to be painting the plate, but. I mean, overall, this is a really cute collection. I love it. I think they really hit it out of the park with this collection. Now this whole this whole section of the ink and paint collection is, is one of my favorites because I love the little details on these reusable uh, cups. Like look at how pretty that is. And then you have the junior cups which have the paint slurshing down. Yes, slurshing is a word. This is what I really wanted to save up for for us eventually is these cups. Like it's, I love the Lady and the Tramp, and oh, I think it has Toad on it and Bambi on the other side. And those are $34.99 for a set of four. These cups are really nautical. Look at with the striping, very summery, like that. And of course, appropriately, the towels are right under there. Look what's next to the towels. Oh. Mini uh, pool float. That is cool. And then these are little Minnie and uh, Mickey donut uh, drink holders that float. Oh, so you get those with this. And then you got a whole set. You float around. Oh yeah. We've seen these before, but it was just worth mentioning again because they're all raised. Really neat. Wow, look at all these mugs. So not many of these are very new. Look at the pizza planet with Forky. Oh my god. Oh, hey, this looks fairly new. Yeah, look at that. The gold standard. Newer. Mine, mine, mine. Castle on it. That's interesting. This is really neat too. Is that is that um, Mary, Mary Poppins? Poppins? That is yeah. great. That's an old old classic mug. They've had this that is also a nice time. classic mug. Look at that. Yeah, that one's like fantasy and fantasy land. Katie, I would like adventure in a great wide somewhere. Do you know what princess says that? I do not. <gasps> Spencer. Okay, it's from uh, Beauty and the Beast. Belle says that. Oh, okay. I want adventure in the great wide somewhere. I want it more than Very good. And they still got the Lion King face mug that you can hold up as you're sipping and you look just like the lion, which is really cool. Okay, big fan here, look at this. Haunted Mansion going our way. I am, heck yeah, that is a great tumbler. Look, there's Mickey. Oh my gosh, it's her. She she was dipped in blue paint. She was, she was forever memorialized. That's literally her size too. And then the other guys hanging out, showing off the products. And for some reason, under the dogs, we've got socks. Yeah, uh, this is the cat collection. Oh, look at that. So it's got Scar and all the cats, nice. Aristocats, and the best one is the dog collection. So it has all the dogs on it. Nice. There's Nana, Pluto. Everybody's there. That's great. And the Disney Tail section has become so comprehensive. It's just out of control. Like, 
They've even got placemats for the dog bowls, the spaghetti. That is brilliant for Lady and the Tramp. Oh my gosh. I'm thinking about getting this princess collar for Binky. Oh, that's very, that's very Binky right there. Isn't it? She would like that. I think she might like a Haunted Mansion one. I don't know. Giddy, they even have outfits for the doggies. Oh yeah, the harness. Those are the harnesses. You could be a ghost host. Oh my gosh. She would like that. So here's the placemat that we uh, saw outside, or AKA the feeding mat. Yeah. How much is it? Uh, it's $19.99. Okay. They've also got a couple other versions. The dog bone with all the Mickeys and, and the mini. Yeah, a mini bow and a, and a dog bone. And look at all the different outfits you can get. Oh my gosh. As well as, this was the t-shirt we were looking at for Binky because it matched Katie. She has that sweatshirt. They still don't have her size. They still don't have her size, but look at all these other options. Small but mischievous, yes. That is Chippendale. And look, a little Tinkerbell. And there's Binky right there. She's donning her spirit jersey. Look at that. More doggy spirit jerseys. Look at this. Okay, we wandered back over to the front. Katie has found measuring spoons. Oh, I need that. a new set. Really I love all the bad. colors. That's a good idea. I really need those. They're so cute. And then we've got the cookie cutout set. Oh, we love those. We, we would have uh, been able to use those for sure. Yes. This is something that I've always wanted for the drain. Uh, I know. I want the Mickey drain. Look at this baking mold. We can make Mickey cakes. You can make Mickey anything. You yeah. can just make mud pies. Okay, well, maybe not enough. But <laughs> and then what is this? Uh... That's a trivet. I don't know if you say trivet or Excuse trivet. Me? Well, that's what you put pans and stuff on. You talking about you talking about Walker Texas Rangers partner, Trivet? What? I don't understand. Okay, stackable salt and pepper set. That's cool. What is that? Is that another mold? Silicone rubber. So yeah, it's a mold. Oh, yeah, it's so pancake you can mold. make pancakes. Oh, uh, so when we go free Yeah. So, so that's better than when we go freestyle and we do yeah. them, which we're pretty good at those, but like better that's a that's kind of a guarantee. Okay, look at all this cute stuff here. This is like amazing. I thought this was small world, but now I realize it's Beauty and the Beast. Oh, it does have a kind of a small world esque vibe. I know, vibe. right? Just a little bit. Well, it's the way that that is outlined in yellow yeah. and just the, I don't know. Look at all this cute stuff. There's the uh, coffee scoop. Oh yeah. And I love this whole character line because basically it's, it's, like, it's like the kitchen utensils are Disney bounding, kind of. Yeah. If that makes any sense. Same with these shot glasses, they're Disney bounding. All right, we're looking at aprons uh, now. We have Belle and the Beast. Oh yeah, they're together. And then we have over here Mickey and Minnie. Obviously, yes. I really want the Minnie one. Ooh, oh whoa, this is cool. I know. I like that the Mickey is impressed on there. What is that? I think that's where you put your spoons on, if I'm oh, not mistaken. Oh, okay. I want to just check. Yeah, it's just, I think it's what you put your spoons on. You know how, like, we have, you put it on your, um, when you're, uh, you're on your stove. Well, you're stirring th something stirring and then you put it on there yeah, like in the this interim. Yeah, one that I'm getting. Oh, it's like a Mickey balloon. Yeah. Um, look at this ball, by the way. Oh my gosh. Isn't that cute? I love that. Let's not forget the cookie jar. <laughs> I like I like this one a lot, the graphic nature of it. And look at these pop-out measuring cups. It's silicone and you can flatten them like that for storage and then pop them out. See that? That makes a, so cute. Makes a lot of sense. More Mickey molds. Cut out. Some good magnets, huh? Oh yeah. And the salt and pepper shakers underneath. Salt and peppers here. Salt, 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 salt and peppers here. Even the child is represented here, which is good to see. Love these great little, almost almost like mac cats, but little statues that you can. Oh, hello. There we are. Even the tile in here. Look at the tile with the hidden Mickey's in there. It looks like Malibu tile. That's amazing. And weirdly, we're almost into the Halloween season because come August, it starts happening out here, anyways. And look, got all sorts of. Jack Skellington, Haunted Mansion, the Hitchhiking Ghosts, Phineas, Ezra, and Gus. Look at them in front of the gates. The gates are even closed for them. Well, hello, Hatbox Ghost. Well, that's a cool Haunted Mansion puzzle. I like that. <laughs> Look at Tinkerbell all lit up. That's pretty good. All right, leaving home now. 
Well, that was enjoyable. I know you enjoy the shopping oh, videos. Oh, I enjoyed it so much. That was so much fun. I think Birch Search was invented purely for you. I think so. Um, I'm gonna have to agree with yeah. you. Yeah. But if you guys like that video, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That's right. And we will see you next time on Best Life and Beyond. Bye-bye, everybody.